How does Ryanair, Europe's most famous low-budget airline, use dynamic pricing? Airline pricing has seen a continual evolution as there is more and more pressure to drive costs down and drive profits up. Filling up seats is not as simple as it may seem. Every aircraft is classified into classes or blocks to maximize airline revenue. The typical Ryanair aircraft, the Boeing 737, has around 189 seats. The pricing strategy loosely follows a kind of blocking of different batches of seats that are then subject to external dynamic factors like the type of sector, maybe business or leisure, seasonality of demand, special events and holidays, historic booking trends, etc. Let's assume that this is how static pricing starts for a typical Ryanair flight. So, depending on how many seats have been sold, a price is accordingly fixed for your ticket. But of course, as the date of the flight comes closer, and if they've still not recovered the cost of making the flight, they may further pull down the numbers, so that instead of paying 60 euros for the 40 to 59 block or class, you pay 50 euros, and then 60 euros for the 60 to 99 block, and so on. This only leaves the last class, which is anyway the purely money-making class but they can charge whatever they want to, possibly even up to 400 or 500 euros. This is how the analytic systems in Ryanair's booking mechanisms automatically respond to changes in demand and in ticket inventory. 